After playing with robots and coding up your own robots, it's time to make discoveries with robots. This, the discovery track, you begin by submitting coding assignments to demonstrate your ability. If you pass all of the assignments, you graduate to scientist. Now, you can work with us and other users to perform experiments and write up research papers. Here's how the process works. In order to prove that you're able to do research, you first have to serve as a teacher and student. In other words, you need to submit assignments for grading and grade the work of others. There are 10 assignments in total. Let's assume you've already submitted the first assignment and are now submitting assignment two. User one grades your assignment and passes you. Congratulations. Before you can move on, however, you need to prove your worth as a teacher. Let's assume that a new user submits the first assignment. You've already completed the first assignment, so you are asked to grade it. You give user two a passing grade. Now you've completed the work at your level and graded a piece of work from the level below. You level up. After leveling up 10 times, you graduate to scientist. You can now work with others to answer a research question or hypothesis. Let's imagine that you choose to help determine whether a four-legged robot, or quadruped, can run faster than a six-legged robot, or a hexapod. You and user one write code to simulate two different kinds of quadruped, while user two writes code to simulate a hexapod. The three of you now simulate the robots you've created and compare their speeds. It looks like the hexapod is faster. Together, you write up your findings and submit them for publication. Thanks for joining us. We look forward to conducting research with you right here on Ludobots.